as you were doing when I got home. At least it will take my mind off of my... <laughs> ...condition. Well, we wanted to ask you for your help with our school talent show, Colby. Oh, I would love to help, but first, what is a talent show? A talent show is when we get to show off our talent in front of the whole school. That sounds like fun. <laughs> Don't you think that's a great way to tell all our neighborhood friends about Jesus, Colby? Oh, my, yes, but... <laughs> There's something that doesn't seem quite right about showing off your talents to tell your friends about Jesus. What do you mean, Colby? Well, I'm not quite sure. All of my memory pathways are so congested, and I just can't figure it out. Maybe it will come to me if you all tell me what it is you're going to do. Well, Jessica and I are going to sing a song together. Oh! oh. And me and Bo, we're going to do this really cool rap. Some other kids are doing a dance or putting on a funny skit. That all sounds wonderful. And what are you going to do, Paulina? Oh, I'm not going. I'm not into singing and dancing instead. Well, if you don't want to sing or dance, there must be something you could do to show your talent. No, I really don't have any talents. You do so have talents, Paulina. Yeah, everybody's good at it. Something. Yeah. Look, I just don't want to, okay? I've got homework. I'll see you guys later. Oh, dear. Oh, my. Colby, I wasn't trying to upset her. I know. Hmm. Something is coming up on my disk drive. Why, of course. What is it, Colby? Well, I've been scanning through my files to see what isn't making sense about showing off your talents to tell others about Jesus. And I believe I've come up with part of the answer. You see, God gives different gifts and talents to every person. But the important thing is using those talents to serve the Lord, not to show off in front of your friends. Like a treasure in your heart. Of diamonds, pearls, and gold. You have talents that he gave as gifts for you to hold. So let this gift he gave to you bring glory to his name. 
Paulina. Yeah, I think we should try and find her. That's a good idea. Come on. Colby, I really do want to serve the Lord with my talents. Oh, I agree, but there's still more about this in the scriptures, and oh, I can't seem to access all of my memory. <laughs> oh, good. I think Flip and Flop are here. Oh. oh. I'm so glad you're here. Chloe's really yeah. sick. Oh. I'm feeling a bit dizzy. Flop and I will do our best. We'll do a diagnostic test. Mm -hmm. Well, Colby's got a bug, it seems, and we must fix him. By all means, we'll find whatever's on the fritz. Cause of we're the diagnostic dish. Should we remind them who we are? Well, chum, I think that's just what the doctor ordered. Yeah, right. We are the double diagnostic discs. Specially made for cases such as this. Remember which? Oh, now you've caused a glitch. Ah, uh, what? A uh, glitch, you know. A uh, 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 programming mistake. Oh, give me a break. Oh, isn't that just the icing on the cake? Cake? <laughs> cake? I'll go get a plate. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Oh, I've got such a headache. But we are the double diagnostic dish. Especially made for cases such as this. There can be no guarantee It will do our best, you see To, to make our analysis Yes, yes we'll, we'll make our analysis Now <laughs> <laughs> oh, get off, get off, yeah, what are you right, doing? Yeah, right. Oh, look, there's 
the chip, without a doubt. We'll pry it loose and take it out. Now we'll do the right repair. We'll make it fit right back in there. Oh my, oh, that is better. My sneezing is gone, but, oh dear. I still can't access all my memory. Flip it, Flop. Can't you fix Colby? Well, uh, uh, well, after some examination... We found some more contamination. Yes. Uh, we are... <laughs> what was that strange sensation? I think it was... A sneeze! Ah, a sneeze? <laughs> A sneeze! A sneeze! That's what you've got! <laughs> that means this virus can be caught! And I would! I've got it too! Oh, 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 whatever will we do? We'll have to find an antidote! Yes! We better leave upon that now! Yes! Off to the programmer we go. Before our circuitry we blow. Blow? Yeah. <laughs> now come on, Flip. You're so slow. Well, if you say so. Programmer. I don't get it. Well, I believe Flip and Flop were going to find a cure for that computer virus. Wow, Colby. That virus sure must be contagious. Flip and Flop caught it too. Why, yes, I know it's true. Seems Flip and Flop have caught my flu. <laughs> oh dear. What's wrong with me? I just can't stop my rhyming spree. It's okay, Colby. You'll be okay. Oh. If I don't stop this rhyming quick, we'll all be very, very sick. Hold everything, Colby. Looks like you just bumped this knob on the back of your head a bit. I'll fix it. There. Oh, thank you, Bo. That is a little better. Well, at least you stopped rhyming. What happened, Colby? Well, I seem to have lost some of the scriptures that have been programmed into my memory. It's sort of like having a talent, but forgetting what it's supposed to be used for. You see, I know God has given me the gift of teaching children and making music, but unless I use my programming for him, I'm just spinning my disc. Oh, I wish I had never gone into that computer store. Even though there were so many wonderful programs there, they weren't really designed to help me serve the Lord. Why not, Colby? Because in order for me to serve him, I just have to use what I've been given. Not to please myself or others, but to please the Lord. Oh, if only I could access my scripture files, I would know where that verse comes from. I remember, Colby. It's in the book of Colossians, chapter 3, verse 17.
Hello, Paulina. Uh, I've been thinking. And, well, I just want to say I'm sorry for getting mad. I mean, I can't really sing or dance. Well, Paulina, we were just talking about that. You see, God gives different talents to everybody, and it's important that we use those talents he gives us, not for ourselves, but to please the Lord. You know, I think I'm learning the same lesson you are, Paulina. Remember when I went into that computer store and saw all those wonderful programs? I just had to have them all. But I forgot something very important. What's that, Colby? Well, I forgot that in order for God to use me, I just have to use the gifts I've been given, the gift of teaching children through music and song. Do you remember how we learned in the body of Christ everyone has a special gift? Yeah. yeah. So we shouldn't be jealous of another person's gift. Yeah, I guess you're right, Colby, but that's kind of hard. Well, Jessica, think about it this way. You know how God made every animal different? Can you imagine what it would be like if all the animals were jealous of what another animal could do? <laughs> yeah, that'd be kind of like if a giraffe was upset because he wasn't a bird and couldn't fly. <laughs> it's a good thing giraffes can't fly. Yeah, or if a duck got jealous of a gopher because he couldn't dig in the ground. <laughs>
<laughs> we thought your files had disappeared. But it was not as we had feared. <laughs> we finally found a brand new cure. Are you sure? Well, do you see us badly wheezing? We found a cure for all that sneezing. And it was I who saved the day. What? It didn't quite happen that way. Now yeah, you know it did. No, I think you better get your memory fixed. What are you talking that's about? That's right. You that's what I say. I no, I, I can't believe you'd say something like that. Excuse me. Yes? Would you mind terribly installing the file you just fixed? Yeah. No. Well, of course we will. Of course we will. Now, if you'll just be very still. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, there are all my scripture files just as I remember them. <laughs> Oh, it is so wonderful to be able to remember all the scriptures again. You never know when they may come in handy. Hmm. Oh, yes. Now it's beginning to make sense. What's beginning to make sense, Colby? Why, your talent show, of course. Oh, yes, it is all very clear to me now. Huh? Remember when you were all talking about showing off your talents to tell your friends about Jesus? That's right. And remember I said that something was not quite right about that? Well, what is it, Colby? Well, I just realized that you can never really serve the Lord, even with all the wonderful gifts and talents that you have, if you don't have the right attitude in your heart. Well, how do you get the right attitude in your heart, Colby? Well, Danielle, that's where the Lord comes in. You see, if you just open your heart and ask the Lord for a heart to give, then he will do the rest. Colby, I think God has changed my heart. Mine too, Paulina. You mean you've been repaired, Colby. Even more than just repaired, Zane, I feel like I've been renewed. You see, God knew that I needed to learn to be content with what he has given me. That's right, but just remember what we found. This virus can come back around. When you forget to be content, this virus can come back. Uh, oh, Flop. 
Are you sure? One hundred percent! Wow! You mean Colby can get this virus again? I think anyone can get this virus, Bo. That's right! Whenever you become obsessed... Then you forget how you've been blessed! <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> Just kidding! <laughs> Come on, boys and girls! <laughs> you see what could happen when all you could think of are things that you want? Not only did I get a computer virus, but I also forgot to be thankful for all the many things he has given me. You're right, Colby. I think we can all get that virus. Oh, it is all becoming very clear to me now. My gift is to use the scriptures and the music programmed into my memory to bless children. After all, every one of us has different gifts, and when we use the gifts he's given us, we can make a big difference in the world around us. feeling upset about not performing in the talent show, I was feeling a little bit sorry for myself because I'm not a great singer. But I forgot there's a lot of ways to serve the Lord with my talents besides being on stage. We're sorry we made you feel left out, Paulina. Yeah. That's all right, you guys. Yeah, hey, I've got a great idea, you guys. You know something I am good and I really want to use it to help all of you. That's great, Paulina. What are you going to do? Well, last year my grandma taught me how to sew, and I really like to help make costumes for all of you guys to wear in the talent show. Oh, yeah. 